this is uh, Saturday, the 14th of March. Might have a lot of background noise. What well, I came over to the in town lot to do was load up my Covington planter. And while we're here, we're doing the maintenance run on my new John Deere 2030. That's when I had to uh, have the injection pump rebuilt. Did a lot of other work to it. Started right up. My case. Uh, 480E loader landscaper I haven't used since last July uh, my battery was weak I want to take it home and put on that high dollar charger I just bought and recondition it it's not all the way dead it's just weak put on a spare battery I got here and the old loader landscaper turned over about three times cranked right up what I need it for is a front end loader to lift my Covington planter. This is a planter I rebuilt, I used one time, and it works just like a new one now. Brand new, they're only 1,350, uh, 1,475 if you get the sweeps instead of the scratchers. I want to show you the difference. This is a little three point cultivator I picked up, dirt cheap. It's on Craigslist, but I haven't got a nibble yet. Down here, we call these scratchers. They're not really good for cultivating, depending on your soil type. If it's sand, like really sandy, they'll do okay. But look at the spacing. Now it's just really wide apart, and you won't get much action here between the tines. Now, what we also use over here. This is another three-point cultivator. I swapped out the scratchers and put on the true sweeps. These are the sweeps. If you look, this edge is in line with that edge, so you get thorough cleaning when you're cultivating. Uh, this one I'm keeping. Again, surface rust does not concern me in the least. And what someone had done at one point, I believe this is actually a Leibach, or a Covington and they had uh, taken the planter off and were just using the cultivator portion. Well, it has a lot of aspects that are very similar to the cultivator section on the Covington over there. Uh, difference being the extra sweeps. Had to move the John Deere 1050 get it out the way. And this is specifically for my buddy Tom at Prepper Life. Uh, he's trying to figure out how to keep the weeds out of his garden he's fixing to plant. And Tom, this is what you want. It's a three point, goes behind your little uh, Kubota to get the sweeps. Don't get the scratchers. Uh, use Craigslist, these things run for anywhere from 150 to 250. And if they have new or real new sweeps, you had about a hundred bucks. Uh, they're about anywhere from 12 to 24, depending on what aftermarket site you're on. But Tom, you're going to need three on each side, just like this one set up, and not just two. And that way you'll be able to cultivate. Uh, I've had that disc for a couple of years now. It's real nice. It's a lamb pride, pretty heavy. It does real good. Anyway. We're going to get uh, hooked on to a trailer. This thing will fit in the bed of my pickup, but I don't want to tear up my fender flares on my one ton, so we're just going to hook on to a trailer and use the trailer to haul it. Anyway, that's all for this one, and I'll do another one later today with all the seeds we bought. We got a bunch. Thank you.